another bejeweled, bedazzling lifestyles of the rich and famous. Your VIP ticket to the 24 karat core of success. The Final Frontier. Your host is Robin Leach, who circles the globe to uncover the stories America will never stop talking about. Richest car auction. A no-risk flutter for play-it-safe high rollers. Forty-two antique cars went under the hammer in 48 hours of frantic bidding. By the time the gavel slammed down for the last time, nearly $22 million had changed hands. 7,500 super-rich car buffs put their mouth where their money is to bid for rare Pierce Arrows, sleek SS Mercedes, regal Rolls Royces, even vintage collectibles so ancient they had to be rolled on stage. Hollywood super agent Ken Cragen and former monkey Mike Naismith spotted a copper-colored caddy classic. The $27,000 price tag didn't phase the former teen idol. He went eight for the auto and cast the winning bid. This is a good car. This is a 57 Cadillac. But end up buying it for less than you pay for a new Mercedes or a Rolls, and it's uh, twice the car. So I'm going to take it back to L.A. and drive it around. Bidding became so frenzied that at 1.30 cars sold in just 50 minutes of quick fire, going, going, gone. But the bank buster proved to be a real doozy. Oh, this is it, ladies and gentlemen. Do you want to meet anymore? Anybody else anywhere on a great piece of history and a million more? I sold the car! Sold for 1.1 million. But on this occasion, the greenback dollar was shut down by the supercharged Swiss franc. The winning bid was a yodel from a Swiss collector. JB brings the car back to uh, Switzerland, to the garage where he has been built. Cold comfort for the outdone diehards who Swiss missed out. Maybe next year they'll drive away a dream at the world's most expensive car auction. Vroom, vroom. Hair on your back. The trade deficit 